please, I beg you, listen to me. It is the name of the game. This is how it works. The Bible described it so properly or perfectly when it was like when a demon has been cast out from a person and it goes and does not find a play, proper place, it then goes back. And if it finds that it can still access that person again, it makes sure that it invites more demons stronger than before so that when it occupies that power, the same, very same amount of power that they removed it before so that it can, that power cannot remove it again. It's like it comes back stronger than before so that whenever that same attack comes back, it is able to withstand and conquer the time around. That is why that person will be worse than before. You pray like how you did before, it no longer works. Now you have to increase or upgrade. Listen, do not give up. They are coming more stronger and as many. Do not let them win. Do not relax and say, you know what, I'm quitting. I don't know how many people throughout my Christian walk Anybody that has been to a point where they give up, like, I mean, direct give, I'm not talking about being tired. You know what I'm saying? Like, you're still a Christian, you're still going to church, you're just no longer praying as you used to. I'm talking about someone for that they totally stop praying altogether, going to church, they just like that. In fact, I don't remember even one person whom I can just tell when they were there, that is when the Lord came through. Anybody who has let go, it seems like the situation would get worse. And they realize, ah, man, it seems like I was better off back then. Although things were not actually according to how I really wanted. But now, things are just worse. That time, I would not sleep in an empty stomach. Now, I can even sleep in an empty stomach. That time, at least, I don't know, you know. Like, there's even this guy. He once said so He was after he had backslidden from the church. He told me directly, he was like, you know what? Now I realize that my life was better back then when I was committed to the Lord. I wish I can go back, but it was harder. Even to this very day, it's been all more, more than, I believe even more than, if not almost, it's more than 10 years back. But even to this very day, he can't come to church. Once in a while, um, maybe once every two years or so, I don't know the last time I saw him, but... It was hard. And I'm telling you right now, the Lord says, do not give up. Do not give up. I pray for you for the strength. May the Lord strengthen you right now like he strengthened Elijah. Telling him the journey is still long. Sometimes you might feel like this is it, you are done. But the Lord knows the journey is still long. And what does he do is to strengthen you. Be strengthened right now in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. And of course, that's all I had. My details on the comment section below. See you next time.